What's up YouTube? Today we're going to look for video games and of course VHS videotapes on this ride along. Let's go. What up YouTube? Yep, that's right. Today we are going on a ride along. Uh, what I want to fucking do is uh, focus today on looking for uh, PlayStation 1 games, PlayStation 2 games, DS games. Try and find a lot of games because um, games do sell for a bit. So that's what we're going to try and look for at op shops, but it never goes the way you plan because I'll, um, I'll uh, end up finding other random shit. And hey, if I end up finding, uh, if I end up finding some videos, books, I don't really like to do books, but kids' books that sell, um, and, uh, you know, cassette tapes go, DVDs, see what I can find, toys, oh, I love looking for toys, but like I said, today's focus, we're going to focus on games, so let's see how good we go with uh, finding the games today, alright? So we're going to go to three op shops, one of them is shit, I know, um, and we're going to go to a local cash converters because uh, they like to sell second hand games. So let's go see what we can find and make some fucking money. Uh, first one I'm going to go to is the Salvos, the good old Salvation Army. Don't do too bad at this store, this store I've found a few video games here and there, never found a VHS video. Uh, let's give this one a crack and fingers crossed we get some video games. Alright, so this uh, op shop is usually pretty good. I usually always go straight to the electronics. Uh, nothing there this time. Uh, always have shit, absolute crap and stupid shit on the shelf. So I always bypass all that crap that people hand in. Uh, but the DVDs, I had a look at that. All overpriced, uh, especially the box sets. Um, all way, way, way overpriced, unfortunately. Um, this fucking uh, CD holder was way overpriced as well. Uh, I was trying to find the games which I found, and they just had some shitty Nintendo Wii games. Um, and some PS3 uh, ones. They always have these old FIFA games and Wii Sport and Carnival games. Uh, I picked up that Ghostbusters game one other uh, episode, if you remember that, from this exact same uh, store, so don't know how they got another copy of that same uh, Ghostbusters one. But yeah, unfortunately, uh, this uh, thrift shop today, which is usually pretty good, was absolute uh, dog shit, and I was in and out, uh, I was in and out pretty damn quick. I didn't look for those books, I never look for the books unless they're kids' books, but uh, yeah, a bit disappointing. Um, there was uh, one Xbox uh, game that I uh, saw had a little bit of value, but it just doesn't sell. Very disappointing. That was shit. That was shit. Uh, yeah, not happy with that one. Let's go to the next one. That was... I was in and out. Fast. Alright, we're at the Good Semis. This is actually my favourite Good Semis, this one. This is a good, good Sammy. Found a lot of games here. Uh, let's give this one a crack. So usually this uh, good Sammy's I find a shitload of games. I found that Castlevania game that time for uh, $3, which I got 50 bucks for. But even the electronics section didn't have anything. It was empty. Uh, the games, there was no games. Asked the lady in the back. She was even surprised. They had one FIFA game, like always. Uh, no videos, and the DVDs were just pretty shit. That was so bad in there, that was so bad. It was, um, no games. There was no games, there was one uh, soccer game and that was it, so. That place has never disappointed me before. It's two dog shits, two dog shits. Cash converters here, I'm gonna check out cash converters. The games will be more pricey, but have a look. So cash converters is always the same. Uh, you always have the power tools that uh, people get rid of, cameras and iPads uh, and guitars. Unfortunately with these places as you see look Donkey Kong there for $49. 
on Super Nintendo. Everything is already jacked up in price. Uh, DVDs, Blu-rays, everything's jacked up already. So I don't know why I went in there. I don't know why. All right, this uh, video has uh, ended up just becoming my head, hasn't it? Because I have found nothing that cash converting with a rip-off as well. You go to these places and all they uh, have is um, those FIFA games and NBA games, but from 2010 and all that. So I'm going to try this Salvation Army I found on the way home. I'm going to try and find some other ones. I, I'm, I, I think I'm done with those shops. I really do. I think it's now, uh, that's why I haven't done ride longs for so long. I think uh, the only way to go is, um, the only way to go is uh, with your uh, good old um, swap meets and uh, garage sales. But I don't fucking know, man. So I found this uh, op shop, this Salvation Army. Been here before, um, and it wasn't too bad. It's very, very small. A lot of toys, which were cool. Uh, I didn't actually look up this Beauty and the Beast uh, Walt Disney figurine. Couldn't be bothered, to be honest. Uh, a lot of baby shit that I just couldn't be bothered with either. I think I just had enough uh, by this stage. Um, there was this little beetle thermometer uh, that I do pick up in a second um, that was two dollars and I put it back here we go but uh, silly me I looked it up and it was uh, selling for about twenty dollars but that's all right I wasn't in the mood at the time because uh, uh, it all been going uh, to dog shit and hadn't been finding anything yet but uh, there is good to come now this is there's so much junk in Australian thrift shops op shops is so crap there's the games and jigsaws, didn't find anything. Uh, Australian op shops are going down the drain. They're going down the toilet, and I'm telling you now, you're putting the prices up just way too high. Way, way too fucking high. Now, here's the books. Uh, Bird's Backyard, what a fucking classic. If you don't know what that is, look it up, America. Uh, I found the games right before the camera drops off here. I find the games in the DVDs and you will see right now what I picked up. Uh, look, I can't complain. I got one. I got one. Woo! And I wasn't going to come to this op shop. So we got uh, Star Wars The Bounty Hunter. I actually found it right as I turned the uh, videoing off thinking that there was no video games. But there was a few video games there. This was the only good one. $5 they wanted, but uh, I got it for 2 bucks. Um, I think this goes for about $20. I had a look at it while I was in there. It's been selling for about 20 bucks, but I'll double check that. Um, looks pretty cool. And I might even have a little crack and play it. We didn't check the disc, so... That disc looks good as well. So, happy with that. We got the book. We got the booklet. It's what we always want. Very happy. Very happy. Let's go find another op shop. Alright, I was just about to call it quits and then I found another uh, another cash converters and Vinny's op shop. Uh, I thought I'd go in there, I didn't film in there, I didn't bother. And thank God I walked past the toy section because I found, and I remember these from when I was a kid, I found this little fella. Now, I don't know if any of you remember this little fucking fella, this puppet. So we found him, he was a dollar. And then this guy as well. Do you remember him? Does this make it all a little bit more familiar? So these two fellas I can get about $20 to $30 each for on eBay. I paid a dollar each for them. If you don't know who they are, it is from the 1988. And um, I saw him first and I wasn't sure but then when I saw uh, the green guy, I knew 100% they were from the land before time in 1998. And they were the puppets uh, from Pizza Hut. So you'd go to Pizza Hut and you'd get the fucking puppets when you get a meal when you're dying in. So I'm going to clean them up, take a photo of them and put them online straight away. Um, and these sell like hotcakes and they look like they sell uh, as soon as you put them on there, if you put them on there for a decent price. Uh, a few marks on there, but uh, we'll get that off. Alright, that's all I'm going to do for today. Uh, it was a pretty shit day. I got, uh, like I said, I got Star Wars Bounty Hunter. Um, got Star Wars Bounty Hunter for $2. And these two 
So all up, I spent uh, four bucks all together. And look, this is about 15, 20, 20. So yeah, 20, 20. So yeah, I'm looking at 55 bucks for my efforts today. $55 from $4. Not bad, but unfortunately I couldn't find a lot more. I, I hate I hate thrift shops in Australia. Thrift shops in the op shops in Australia are shit. They're fucking shit. Um, America have got it good. They've got it so good. Uh, the prices are just going up, and it's just getting stupid. It's just getting so stupid. The prices. Uh, I'm not impressed. So my advice, um, best way to make your money is get up early on a Sunday morning, no matter how hungover you are. Um, and go to those uh, swap meets and markets and try and find all the garage sales you can. All right, like, subscribe. Don't like, subscribe though, the fuck you want. I can't tell you what to do, but it will help me out if you do do a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe, which will be good. All right, uh, more videos coming up. I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Hopefully I get more viewers, but uh, like I said, I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. Too bad I can't find any videos today, but uh, I only got one game. But we've got some toys. I love toys. They're pretty fucking cool. Who didn't like Land Before Time? Pizza Hut toys. Alright guys, see you.